Tonight we're gonna try a science experiment that Jen found. This one's gonna be good. Uh, we have these bowls, right? We think that they're silver. Like, I, I, they look like they're silver. They don't say anything on them, but I think they're silver. And they're really tarnished, like super tarnished. So she found a way to, like, clean them. Detarnish? Is that a correct word? To detarnish them using boiling water, aluminum foil, and baking soda. So we started this water a boiling, and we got some baking soda that we used to like clean out the like desmellerize the freezer. And then we got us a bowl over here. We're gonna try it. Yeah, smoke tornado. <laughs> I thought it was exciting. We're we've taken a larger pot and we've lined it with aluminum foil, and our water is now boiling. I think we have to. Because this has to go in the sink. Okay. So I might want to just... Just so it doesn't make like that gross noise. Okay. Okay, so then we take this... Wait, we put this in the sink? No, we put this in the sink. Okay. And then, oh wait, we gotta get half a cup of this. Okay. Baking soda, half a I cup. Really I'll do it. So you take your boiling water off the heat, and you put it in your sink, and then you put... <gasps> oh no, are you okay? <laughs> yeah, that really They hurt. told us that it was going to foam up. I know, but I didn't listen. And Jen didn't listen. So and then, wait, you put this in here. You put that in there. And then you dump this. Oh my god, this seems so unsafe. It probably is. Oh, oh. Alright, until that bowl is completely submerged. Which it is. And then, and then we, we wait, I guess, right? <laughs> I guess. All right, it's like turning black. Oh no. Are we tarnishing it more? <laughs> I think we what are. What the heck? I don't know. Was that a trick? Cause every time that I heard about it, I thought we were supposed to use like lemon juice. We, I feel like we just got punked. Look you guys, it's working a little bit. Yeah, it's starting to get super shiny. It's, <laughs> I don't know about that. <laughs> but they said what? They said if it's, um, severely tarnished. I think this might be severely tarnished, I guess. It'll take several times. I almost want to like scrub it though. Hey, I... my band name, Severely Tarnished. <laughs> You're so rock and roll. I am. Oh, this is hot. What? I put Don't my hand the... in the water because I was kind of rubbing it with this, but it turns out that you shouldn't do that. Yeah, no. <laughs> I don't think that's waterproof. It is it? No. <laughs> you know what I heard today? What? Uh, what's his name? Do when I whip my hair back and forth. Who? Tay Day? No, the guy that that was like Jimmy Kimmel, and Adam Carolla. Adam Carolla. Now name Dr. another Drew? person. Jimmy Fallon. Oh, okay. That guy. <laughs> I don't know Jimmy. That's all that I could think of. Jimmy Neutron. Doctor Doctor Drew. Yeah. High five for staying up late when you were in middle school <laughs> to listen to the sexy radio I, I show. I listened to it on the radio. Yeah. Yeah. What was it called? I don't know. I think it was called like sex talk. But no, Dr. it's called Drew. Love Line. Love Line. Love Line. Yeah. yeah. I kind of want to know if it'll like detarnish a penny. Let's see. Come on, detarnishing solution. No. What the heck? Have to be fresh. What? Oh. Say, do a wrap, detarnishing solution. <laughs> you need to be fresh. I seem to remember something about lime juice and pennies. Or is that, is that a lie? Dang it, that was a lie too. What about what about lime juice, pennies, and baking soda? Because I, I know how to make solutions. Wait, are you talking to me? No, I'm doing a crazy science experiment right here on the counter. Oh. I wonder if it did anything to the penny though. It's not real lime juice. No! There's a little bit of real lime juice and it's it's acidic. Hey Jen. Hey. Check it out. These balloons are totally fireproof. You wanna try it with yours? That's crazy. Try it. Are you sure? Yeah. They came fireproof. I didn't know that they had that. Yeah, try it. Okay. Just put it right over it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yours isn't fireproof, just mine. You see the burn mark? Oh my gosh, how did you do that? It's got water inside of it. Oh dang, I should have felt yours. Yeah, I win. I 
should have got this one. And see, no matter what. Now try it. No. Yeah, like this. <laughs> <laughs> all in all, I think our bowl is slightly less tarnished. Now it's got this ring around it though. I don't think it's less tarnished at all. It just has a ring of not tarnished. The reason that the balloon with the water doesn't pop is because water is a really good uh, heat conductor. So it pulls all the heat away from the rubber or the elastic, whatever it is that balloons are made of, rubber. So that it doesn't ever, latex, that's what it is. So that it doesn't pop uh, because there's, it doesn't get hot enough. It popped on us because we moved the water around and it got to a spot where there wasn't any water. But that's the whole reasoning behind that. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Nah!